zombies, and that's the end of that. Ah, uh, I just love squeakers. Don't you guys? Another thing I realized I loved is the word, uh. I just recorded another commentary where I counted myself using, uh, like, I'd say close to 200 times. <laughs> just kidding. I didn't actually count it. That would mean I have no life. Oh, by the way, I am John, aka Gluten Free 2, aka The Terminator 7. Don't ask me about the YouTube name. It's a little embarrassing. But anyway, um, there we go again. You know, have you ever guys, have you guys ever thought, you know, why does someone use the word, uh, or, um, and I was trying to think about that. I see it as a type of placeholder. You know, when you're searching for the right word, searching for a way to, uh, complete your thoughts, what do you say? Uh, and it works. Because then people have gotten so comfortable to it. Oh, oh, double clay. I mean, double bouncing Betty kill. Yeah, yeah, I didn't mean to do that, but it all, it all works, man. So, <laughs> I don't remember what I was saying. It was, uh, and then people have become so accustomed to it. Yeah, that's what it was. That when they hear it, you know, they, they don't really realize that someone's saying, um, uh, like 200 times. But anyway, this is a game on World at War. Uh, nothing really flashy. Just a good solid sniping game that kind of shows, you know, how you can get a good KD while, you know, still kind of like chilling out, kind of playing chill. Because most people, when they go for a big KD, they're like, foot away from the screen, like, oh my god! Ah! And it's like, dude, just calm down, man. Please. So, let's see. To recap so far, we got this game is nothing special. I like to camp pretty hard. I got a double bouncing Betty kill. Not a Claymore, like I said. Claymore was wrong. Um, and, uh, the word, uh, is a very, uh, it's like the most frequent word, used word in my vocabulary. Like in the last sentence, I used, uh, two or three times. And, you know, listening to it, most of you probably didn't realize it. You're like, huh, I didn't just realize he did that. But now, you might go back and you might realize that. But you probably won't, because that'd be sad. So here we go, a little pistol whip. I'm like, get out of my house. And we go uh, speed up a little bit, because, you know, pretty quick game. I was having fun with this one, dude. I've had this one up on my computer since June 28th. That is a pretty impressive 58 days before I even tried to record commentary on it. Or I might have tried to record commentary and given up. And then, uh... It might have been even longer. But anyway, it's pretty fun. Second one of the night I'm trying to do because, you know, I need some way to pass my time until baseball season starts again. <sighs> Once baseball season starts, then I'll have something to do. Otherwise, it's just homework and more homework and art. Dude, three art classes is crazy sauce. I, I'm in a advanced art class, and I haven't taken an art class since eighth grade. So... I'm pretty sure my teacher thinks I'm a mental retard. And it it's actually kind of funny. He'll ask me the dumbest questions. He'll be like, John, do you know what this is? And I'll be like, dude, I'm not stupid. And then, I'll, of course, I'll answer, no, I don't know what it is. <laughs> anyway, back to a little more of the gameplay. World at War, like I said. Just kind of camping out inside the building, trying to have a good game. And it's working out pretty well. My teammates here, they were very good, so I liked it. That Murph Show 09. Uh, I think he scored better than me, which is normally not grounds for anyone to put a game up on YouTube if someone scores better than you, but I honestly have no problem with it. I can go plus, let's say, 7, and I will still put it up. My standards for games are quite low. Like, uh, let's say, Search and Destroy. Oh, there's another, ah, uh, just going to point that out. Let's say Search and Destroy. I will put up any game as long as it's 9 kills and less than 3 deaths. Heck, dude, I haven't put up a 9 and 4 game. You know, because I'm not trying to show off scale. I'm not trying to say, hey guys, look at me, I'm a beast. I'm trying to say, hey, I'm having fun with this, you know? I like the sound of my own voice. And it gives me something to do. So please, you guys, if you like it, subscribe. If you don't, sorry, I hope you guys did. I'll catch you on the flip side though, you guys. 22-1-5.
Have a good day. Peace out.